Hey everybody, Thunderbird here. Uh, hope you're having a good day. I'm having a fantastic day. Uh, it is late at night this time, so I will not have my son with me. He's asleep. But today's episode is all going to be about making that first major decision when it comes to Edgewater. I'm on the mission where I need to decide whether I'm turning the power off for the botanical gardens or if I'm turning off the power, the main power that goes to Edgewater. Uh, I'm not sure yet what I'm gonna, what decision I'm gonna make. I'm, I'm leaning towards one way, but I don't wanna give it away. So uh, let's get going and try to see if we can't get through this mission kind of quickly. And that way we can move on and hopefully get one more main mission in this episode. So without further ado, let's go. Oh, hello. Getting a lot of lag right there. Hold on one second while I check something. All right, so we're good there. All right. Oh. New save. All right. So I am level four. I'm just trying to remember, remember exactly where I was real quick. All right. So let's get going. I need to get, I already talked to Adelaide, so I need to get my ass over to uh, the biothermal plant. And I don't know why, but I'm getting some really bad. I was getting some bad screen tearing going on there and some lag, but it looks like I'm okay now. Well, as I say that, I get a little bit. Absolutely love this weapon. Who thinks they see me? I love the uh, the facial expressions they make when you kill them. They basically die looking like they're about to charge you. Which threw me off the first time I played this game. It felt very weird looking at them. I, I always thought they were getting ready to jump scare me. I'm going to switch out of this weapon because I don't have too many bullets with it. back of my ship. He doesn't see me. He thinks he sees me. And I got TTD back too, so as soon as this person comes around the corner, they're mine. Grass is grass. I love this weapon has been a great pickup. It's been working out really well for me. I have zero complaints. And I have shit tons of ammo. Almost 500 rounds. I'll pick that up just so I can do this. Bam. Don't care. Don't care, don't care. Got some weapon parts on me now, so we're good there. I think I saw some another enemy up here. I absolutely did. All right, so they haven't seen me yet, so let's sneak around here. Let's see, I'm gonna use my big boy on this guy, on these guys. There's a person here. 
Is there anything I can blow up next to them? There is not. It's okay. Got him. All right. So yeah, putting that scope on this guy has been a great decision. It makes us much more viable from a long distance. So I'm able to do a little more sneaking, which I haven't really done in previous playthroughs. Come on, stand up. I can't stand up here? All right. Now can I stand up? I can. So let's pick up everything we can. I'll pick that guy up just to destroy it. I love the fact that you're able to break down weapons without having to go carry them around and then wait till you get to a workbench of some sort. It's a great benefit to break it down while you're on the run uh, because you're able to basically make sure you're never over encumbered and then also you're able to consistently make sure that you're holding on to weapon parts so when you do come up to a workbench you're able to actually right away repair it upgrade it modify it tinker it whatever you need to do although i'm pretty sure i can repair on the go i can repair what is this guy at we're good but i can't tinker i can't tinker modify So when I get an opportunity to do something like that, I have all the necessary components and I can just get to it. Also, ah, now that I'm not, I don't need that really bad looking facial hair from my Halloween costume because Halloween's over, I was able to shave. So I don't look like a uh, person that hangs outside of uh, elementary school playgrounds as one person put it. Okay, why, oh. I've said this multiple times, and I always say I'm beating the dead horse here, but they don't put ladders like that in the, in the game for no reason. I'm assuming at one point if I would have stood there long enough, one of these guys would have come up this ramp and sat down and hung out. I wonder, should I go that route or should I go up and around? I think I'm going to go up and around. See if that was a bad decision or not. Oh, there's something up here. Building of some sort. Let's see if there's any bad guys. I don't see anybody over here. Let's peek around the corner. What is going on? So apparently if I try to go to the left there, it's too steep. And not only can I not go up it, it kicks me down. So I'm at the volcanic, volcanic Summit. I also need to drink something. So let's use this guy. That actually did not help at all. Great. That helped a little bit. So is this just literally a volcano? It is. Well, that's kind of cool. I'm sure my son will be mad at me that I went all the way up here and looked at that without him. If you watched last episode, you know he's, uh, when he saw that in the distance, he was like, is that a volcano? Oh God, no. See if I can't. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Come on.
Again, look at the facial expression on that behemoth. He, he looks like he's alive and he's getting ready to, to run at me. Oh, headshot. There's it, the bullets do not drop at all. So wherever you're aiming is exactly where it goes. Okay, little guy, where are you at? You think you're gonna get to me? Oh no, that was bad. Bring this shit. Let's go. Come on. badass. Alright, let's grab all my goodies from these guys. I got primal brain off of him, huh? It's kind of gross. Let's check to see if there's any other Fun people hanging out over here. Nobody that I see, although I'm pretty sure there's... Yep. I was going to say, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of loot over here. It makes sense. It's a down ship. I'm assuming a cargo ship, because it's Spacer's Choice. And here's the... Uh, like the Kind of like a cargo ship that goes on the ocean. This is kind of like the holder. The All right, so it's a dude right here. Get got, kid. All right, so let's break down some of this extra stuff I picked up. It's only armor four. But it gives you stealth skills, don't care, break down. What are you at? 98%. Why do you... I wish it didn't throw up the... I guess you, it slowly decreases in how much it highlights. The, the more broken down it gets. Which I guess is kind of cool. Did I pick up a second plasma rifle? I did. Is there anything special about this one? There's not. It's level 6. You're gone there. Oh God, the bane of my existence, the Codex. Has anybody used the Codex ever? <laughs> it just literally shows you exactly what you've already, all the help things you've already read on the screen before. I mean, I, I, I guess, thank you, but if I already read it, why do I need you to appear again? Here's the guy that I headshotted, which should mean the other buddy should be just back here. Where are you at? Why did it sound almost like something was running behind me? All right, so let's deal with some of these issues I'm having. My guy's hungry. Okay, so where did that go if I removed it from junk? Oh my God, whatever. Eat some bread. Yeah, that should have taken care of everything. Thank you. Where is the second guy I shot? I want your ammo, buddy. Where are you at? Could have swore he was right up here. No? Oh, that's nice. Beautiful. Sure, they didn't mean for that to be seen. 
He might have turned to goo and I can't find it, or dust or whatever you want to refer to it as, and I can't find it now. So let's not worry about that. Let's get this guy out and prepare for what I'm about to find over here. Which, if you haven't been over here yet, you haven't played the game yet, or you've just been dicking around and you haven't played the main mission yet. Uh, although I think it forces you to play this. Uh, you just This is your first bout with a lot of machines. I think I'm good there. Good try, good try. Poke your little head out, dude. Oh, come on. Reload. I don't know what his problem was. Why he didn't stop and turn or look at me or anything. He just kept going. Come on, really? I need as much of that ammo as I can get. And you're going to tell me I can't interact with him now? Whatever. And even though I killed those guys, you still have to be very careful. Because sometimes, just like marauders, they like to hang out and be like, Oh, I didn't hear all that battling going on. And you'll turn a corner and all of a sudden there's like two more. 20 feet away from where you just did all the shooting. And you're like, how? How did you not... This explodes, it looks like. Yeah, it does. It gives off electricity. I've never seen that before. They just act completely oblivious to everything that was happening in the same general vicinity that they were all hanging out. It's like, how? How are you that naive, that dumb, that unobservant? There's got to be something over here. Other than just these boxes you can blow up. Oh, there's a bad guy. See? Told you. Where you at, dumb? Oh, he's over here. Come on, buddy. Yep. Come at me. Come on. I want to see what these blue crates do to them. I almost did nothing. I like how his buddy just left him out high and dry too. He's red. As if he can see me and he's gonna come get me. And he hasn't done jack. He's just hanging out back there. I don't know what to do. Oh, there's fighting going on? Dumbass. Alright, so let's get out my big boy gun. And let's show this boy uh, a good time. One shot at him. Noise. Alright, let's get out of this crouch sneak mode crap. Got more armor parts. Right. There's nothing to loot over here. How is that possible? I could have swore there was stuff to loot. It 
it's a little sucky in this game how you can't take armor off of people. Like, I would like to take this guy's, the Spacer Choice Guard's armor off of them. Why not? Okay, what does this even do? Some security fences. Don't care about the logs. Oh, can't make it up there. Nothing in there. Already looted you guys. Oh, didn't loot you. Nothing in you. Fun. Anything over here? Nope. So there's those guys over there. And you guys over here. See, there we go. Elite Trooper Armor. I want to see what that is. Yeah, I know. I'm going to... Don't you worry, baby bird. I'll feed you. Light Assault Rifle. Assault Rifle. I don't need a Light Assault Rifle. What is this guy? 51. You're like the worst thing I have. Yeah, sorry, buddy. Okay, so what kind of damage or armor do you give? 17. What do you do? 11. Definitely don't need you. Yeah, over encumbered. Guarantee that's what it's about. Oh. You cannot sprint or fast travel. Well, cool. I can't fast travel anyways because I'm playing Supernova. So thanks for reinforcing that fact. I'll take it and then I'll break it down. Gotta love those weapon parts. Let's see if there's anything over here. Aha. Better be something good in here if I'm wasting. Bolter pistol. Hmm. What are you? 22 damage times three. Magazine size is pretty large. It does stagger. It uses energy though. And I already have <sighs> some stuff that uses energy. What condition are you guys in? Ooh gonna repair you so you have 71 weapon parts from breaking down all those weapons I'm not using that I, I could have probably just left on the ground but instead I picked them up and I'm glad I did I just want to see how many armor parts I have 27 cool cool who thinks they see me oh that guy Huh. I've never gotten a kill cam like that. That's pretty cool. In previous playthroughs, only uh, only companions have gotten that, the cool kill cams that they have. Picking up lots and lots of ammo, which is a good thing. I wonder what I can get off of those guys. You guys turned to dust? What happened to you? Is this you right here? No. This is you. Terror beak. You turned to dust. Then you get nothing. Alright, before I get too far out of the way and get completely distracted. Oh, there's some primals over there. Let's just take care of this mission. Let's do what we came here for. So real quick, loot these guys. I'll break that down. Oh, there's a guy right there. Bypass stump. Nice, nice. So let's do what we came here for. Let's uh let's take care of this biothermal. Or geothermal power plant. And for how much this game packs into certain areas, it is 
pretty amazing how small the loading screens are. Alright, can I sell to these guys anymore? Oh, I fucking can't still. <sighs> Basically mac and cheese. Sure, I'll buy all three. I need water. Where's energy? Let's just go over here. Energy cell, there we go. Let's buy 26. <laughs> All right, so there's a bad guy over here. Oh, come on. Not gonna lie, that kills. The kill cam is kind of freaking me out because it's not in, and it hasn't been in any of my other playthroughs, especially. Why can I not interact with this guy? What is wrong with this? It looks like he had some loot, but whatever. I have yet to get any kill cams on any of my other playthroughs when I have followers, so it's a little weird, and it doesn't freak me out, but it it throws me off, I should say. Because typically in the past, kill cams have always meant I die. So when I see a kill cam, I'm like, no way! How did he kill me? But in reality, apparently, it's me doing some kill cams, so... I guess that's a good thing. Hopefully some good stuff in here, some energy. I'll break you down. Got more weapon parts too. Okay, good there. What was the point of even locking that? All I had to do was that. And it did literally nothing. Just put me right back to where I was. Nice. Poor receptionist. Got wrecked. Uh -uh. Keep hitting. On some screens, escape is how you back out. Other screens, it's tab. Can they not just pick one thing and stick to it? Like if you notice on here, escape is the back out. So I'll be in a on a terminal and I'll hit escape, and it's like, oh, you want a quick game? I'm like, no, no, I don't. I'm good. Okay, let's see if it'll let me interact with this guy now. It will not. All right. Whatever. Guess I didn't want your loot anyways. Oh, nope. I do not want to go outside. Good thing I noticed that. So is this guy on the opposite side of the wall? He's not. No, hurry up. Where was this guy this whole time? I really should have used that mag extent. Oh, I guess this doesn't even use a mag, so it wouldn't have worked. I was going to say, I should have used the mag extender on this guy, but... As I always say, they don't put shit like this in here for no reason. So let's see if there's nothing over here. Bingo. And a bypass stuff. So this is kind of cheating. I have played this already, so I know what I can and can't interact with. So I know I can interact with this guy. So it's going to tell me, oh, no, you need to find the three levers and turn them first. So... I need to travel to the other parts of this building, this complex, find the three levers, pull them, and then it'll give me the choice of where to direct, 
redirect the power. I'm a little mean. I kill sprats basically just to get their hides and then sell them for a profit later. I know it's like almost nothing, but if you stack them basically and get a bunch of them, it's a little profit you can make. Can't break into you yet. Okay. What did I get? Some dude's outfit? Worker's outfit. Uh, no, I'm good. I'll break you down. Alright. That's barred. You can't get through there. Oh. Go ahead, buddy. Come all the way up here. Get got, kid. Can't do crap with you. As I always say super out loud, they don't put crap in here like this for nothing. And what do you know? There's a dude hanging out down here. Plant worker. Quiet muzzler. Hmm. I'm assuming that's for long range weapons and I've already used my mods on my plasma rifle, so I won't be able to use that. At least not on that one. Cool, cool. Come on, stand up, there we go. Am I over encumbered again? I am, oof. All right, so what can I get rid of or eat or do? Eat the frozen dinner. Ali Ali Toxy Free. No, that doesn't do anything. It's really lightweight. Bottle of gently squeezed mock apples. Whatever. Alright, so now I can run. Okay. Make sure I'm reloaded. I am. Okay, where are these mofos at? I mean, I'm gonna get over encumbered again. Processing. Might as well reload now. Badass. It uses ammo really fast though. So I need to be careful. Okay, I'll come up here. This is the first switch. Pull that guy, we're good. Just make sure I'm not gonna run into any other bad guys over here. More bits, cool, cool. Can't interact with you, can't interact with you. jump up here I saw from up top this guy all he has is weapon parts though whatevs I 
believe I'm over encumbered again. I am. Are you gonna tell me every single time when I'm over and when I'm encumbered about it? Is that really what's gonna happen right now? No, you're gonna tell me every single time when I use the inhaler. Fun. Kids is woken up. I'm gonna get rid of you, bro. Same with you. I guess I don't need all three. So you use 66, 58, 42. Stun baton. You again. Where you run into this lunatic. No, 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 just leave me alone. Gotta kill this dude real quick. Come on, really? So if you come over here, where is it? Right here. You can shut those valves off. So now you can actually walk around and uh, pick stuff up. So let's get rid of that real quick. All right. So I don't need you. I know, you do not need to tell me every single time I use the inhaler what it does. Really? Thank you. No, no, no. There we go. All right, so let's see what I can modify now. Can I mod you? I can. Somehow I can upgrade your magazine size. Don't know how that's real. It's gonna also add a shock. I'm gonna inset and add the shock. All right, what about you? What kind of mods can I add here? So it gets rid of how much noise range. Okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. What about you? Puts in a bigger. Or adds a shock. Let's do bigger. So anything over here? Can I add any mods here? What do I got here? Toughened. A set of armored plates reinforce a piece of armored protection blocking incoming damage below a certain intensity. Against physical damage. What does this do? What does this guy do? Installs an external sensor netting, which detects interactable objects. Oh, yes, please. So that'll actually allow me to see 
from farther away what actually is interactable, which is of great benefit. You, let's, let's add more damage to you. It's gonna cost me basically all my crap. What about you? You're gonna go to 102. And you're gonna go to 26. I mean, I could make that into a pretty badass. I can't do that one. Repair, you are all good except for you. You do need a repair. You're fine still. Break down, I don't need to break anything down. So here's the second lever. Make sure I didn't miss anything over here real quick. I already went through all that. Good, good, good. All right, let's go up here. I need to be willing to take cover and heal myself during battle much more. I'm used to playing, dude, this is, okay. That is the one bug I've encountered in this game and it's starting to get on my nerves. Cause I can see something. I can see that it has some kind of goods in it and I can't interact with it. I'm pretty much in love with this game. But that is the one downside I've encountered now a handful of times. Make sure none of these guys turned into goo. Dust piles, they did not. Good, good. Make sure there's nothing back here. Of course there is. Getting lots and lots of armor parts. Already picked you up. Is there anything over here I need to pick up? No, no, no. Just you. Do I still even have... Do, yes, I know. Is there a way to turn that off? How much salt tuna do I still have? I don't even know. What are you? Armor rating plus 10. That's pretty cool. Let's do that. I only had one left of Saltuna. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. There it is. The third and final lever I needed to pull. up anything else that I'm missing good there I already did you where's homeboy at I want to talk to him did I miss him somewhere I did Oh, this is the very, very front, so I need to go this way. There we go. Is there a 
Redirect power. <sighs> All right. I'm going to give the big middle finger to Edwater. Fuck the company. Botanical garden people are much more, I would say, closer in my mind to the good. I mean, it is a gray area, definitely, but they are closer to being good in my mind compared to Edgewater, which are just assholes. All right, so what does that get me? Unlock the ability to sell goods. There we go. Finally. I don't care at all about any of that. Two in there. All right. Ooh, if I can get that up two more, I can handgun crit damage 50%. Oh man, fucking A. <laughs> I always do that. Apply. There we go. Because you're dumb, you're dumb. Oh, here's another bug. Why is plant worker? This is fun. I love not being able to see part of my screen. If I remember correctly, some animals have come into this little area as soon as you come out here. See if my memory serves me right. Oh, maybe I got a different reaction this time. Cause I don't see any enemies right now. I'm sure, uh, what was his name? Tobson? Pretty sure that was his name. It's not gonna be too happy with me. Yeah, Reed Tobson, I believe. He's gonna have some choice words for me, but uh, honestly, he can go pound sand. You know, he's a douche. Thinks he can control people. What? What enemies see me and have me up as red? Ooh, is that coming from inside? It is. He wants a piece, huh? All right, let's see what this motherfucker has to say to me. Want a piece, Reed? Let's go, fuck boy. You want to know what gets my bile churning? Edgewater has suffered a cavalcade of disasters. Plague, marauders, desertion. Your fault. Then you wandered in town. And I was so damn sure our luck was starting to turn. I never knew how right I was. Just answer one question for me. Why'd you do it? Because you're an asshole and you don't deserve it. That power regulator is company property. Whatever you were hoping to find down here, I advise you to turn around and leave. I have got guards posted with orders to fire on you. Mm hmm. Well, I don't have a good enough intimidate. That's unfortunate. 
So I'm gonna say I'm sorry, even though I'm really not. won't give us our lives back, but for what it's worth, I am sorry too. Edgewater's dead. Our cannery's dead. Adelaide's deserters are never coming back. No, they're not. Space's choice will shut us down before long. Some of us will die of illness by then. Some will move on. Some will starve. And as for me, I will tender my resignation. Whereupon I shall be processed and then duly imprisoned for gross incompetence. Mm-hmm. Oh, and then I get... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I couldn't have gotten intimidated all the way up to 30 anyways, but that's pretty funny. Let's get it to 20 at least. All right, and let's do this boy. There we go. And let's get you up. And let's get you up. Save those. Go to perks. <laughs> Don't need any of those. Don't need that. I'm probably going to end up using that. Yeah. run into little girl oh what a little pansy read okay I don't see any of those moving so I think I'm good in other playthroughs I've always been able to use intimidate so I've never had an, had to do this fight so this is actually kind of cool it's a uh, different all right so i'm gonna repair you oh no to destroy this entire town looks like I do how to kill Phyllis God, I'm a monster you're a monster Oh, come on! You're telling me I can't interact with this douchebag? That is some bullshit right there. The one person I wanted to steal some crap off of. Ah, Spacer's Choice Mumbo Jumbo Crap. Ooh, what do you know? Where is it gonna be? Nope, 
there's it. It's emergency inhaler. Ooh, a peacekeeper? What is that guy? This gun keeps the peace as well as Mock Apple keeps the doctor away, which is not at all. Okay, so it's really shitty at keeping the peace. Interesting. Well, you're going to keep the peace by going away. Not making me over encumbered anymore. How about that? Use you, use you, use you. Alright, so let's come back down here then. Since I'm already being followed and chased by every single fucking person in this godforsaken town doesn't matter if I steal anymore. So, I'm gonna steal it all. I want it all. And I want it now. Alright, so I'm gonna get rid of you. Get rid of you. Cool, cool. Get rid of you. Interesting people I'm gonna run into on my way out here. We shall see. I'm assuming probably a few cowering residents, most likely. Can we do it, Parvati? Fuck it. did it. I'm a murderer. I killed Parvati. Alexa, play Desposito. Where you at, fucker? Come on out, bud. Damn, I had a sealed door, you little bitch. Alright. I feel like I've used quite a bit of that. It's alright, I got three more. Bro, you do not need to fucking do that every single goddamn time. Parvati, you're a great follower in my other playthroughs. But in this playthrough, your ass was grass. Where is it? Where are these red...
It shows them like in town or something. I was just in town. I slaughtered everybody in there. I'm a monster. Come on. Okay, well. Remember now that when it shows a, like a frightened face above somebody, that means that they are scared of you and they will run away. Cause that thing ran like a bitch. Alright, I'm sure these there's this old dude over here that's probably pissed at me too. So let's let's let him get a piece in. Come on, old man, where you at? I want a piece. There you are. Go ahead. That's what you get for sounding like a douchebag early in the game. Oh no, is he going to turn me in for stealing? Alright. So. Breakdown. You. 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 Repair. I'll repair you. I will repair you. I will repair you. I notice that's probably getting annoying say me saying that every time, so I'll stop. Alright, so. Tinkering. I'm gonna do that. I'm not gonna mod anything, so I'm good to go. What is my weight at? 76. Dude, if you tell me one more time. Okay, you didn't tell me emergency inhaler that time. Thank you. Okay, I really don't care about that. I'm sure that was the only guard over here. And I can sell to them now. Yay! Sell, 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 sell. Yes. There we go. Eleven hundred. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna buy both of you. I need pure water, I need all four. Where is bullets? Energy, 50, I want them all. Whew, changes the damage type to plasma. That's pretty badass. What's the armor rating? 10? 17. <whistles> it's considered heavy. Ooh, and this one's pristine. It cost me 340. Yep, buying it. Now let's go back over here. 
to my tinker. So you are level 14, you are level 17. So if I get rid of you, I need to break down armor. I can't break that down, really. Watch me. Break down. Yes, put you up there. Get out of here. Tinker. So if I tinker you, it's going to up it even more. Let's do it. Can I do it one more time? I could not. All good in the hood. Okay, let's fast travel my way back to the landing site and let's get on our ship. Let's do a really quick reconnaissance to see if there's anything I can kill. Anything I can grab before I get out of here. So is there anything on this side? I've looked on that side of the ship. I didn't even notice I killed the lieutenant during that whole fire firefight. So I killed Parvati and the lieutenant. Oh, this looks like it might be a uh, a marauder encampment. But it looks like they got straight wrecked. Okay, so I'm gonna break you down. There's gotta be some enemies over here, right? If Marauders got their asses handed to them, I'm assuming that whatever did it to them is still around. And my assumptions would be incorrect, it appears. I don't see anything in there. I just see these poor souls over here. I don't see anything there. Just this dude over here. Okay. Not sure why there's a bin if it's empty. Sprat has nothing in it. What was a silver tongue hit? I wonder what that was. Is that it right there? Gyrosite, silver tongue kit. So it's an armor mod. No, oh, I don't, I mean dialogue I guess, but I don't need leadership. Dude, these guys got just absolutely throttled by whatever came through here. I'm assuming like mo most spots, it's gonna be primals that came through and gave these guys a good time. Patched low pressure helmet. What armor rating are you? Not good. Okay, nothing over here. All right, I think we're good. that down real quick all right cool 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 make sure there's nothing I'm missing in here real quick nope nope All right. 
Didn't even give me time to take a drink. Come on, Ada. You gonna acknowledge my presence? Let's see what's inside of this guy. Really? I used all of... So fucking dumb. So it uses heavy, and it only does 18. Whatever, I'll hold on to it, I guess. Does that use heavy? It uses light. Does that use heavy? It does, and it does 28. Yeah, I'm gonna keep the, the just the normal assault rifle. Captain, I have to tech. What can I do for you, Captain? Do you know how to install a power regulator? Of course I do. Outstanding, Captain. Your aptitude for engineering will prove invaluable in the event of another catastrophic engine failure. Our engine room is located behind you, mm -hmm. across the cargo bay, up the ladders. Unfortunately, because I have taken the route I have, with no companions, my ship will be empty and lonely. Mm. And I killed off one of the fan favorite companions right out the bat. Alright, let's what get going. Hey, if you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching and make sure to subscribe in order to get notifications on when the next episode comes live.